it is Evie and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing a full favourites for you all. So I did one of these last year and you guys seem to enjoy it and I also um, asked you guys and a lot of you said you'd like to see this video. So I decided to gather together a few of my full favourites and just put them all for you in a video. So yeah, I really, really do hope you enjoy this. Give it a massive thumbs up and that would just mean the absolute world. And also make sure to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already down below or click on the screen right now on that little subscribe button uh, to subscribe to my channel and that would be amazing and yeah I really really do hope you enjoy this full favourites and let's get started. So the first thing that I have for my favourites is a perfume. I'm going to try and do it sort of like in sections if I can. Um, so I'm starting off with kind of beauty type things. This is the So Sexy perfume and I got this from Superdrug. It was on sale I believe for about £3. I get perfume sometimes and they don't really last uh, but this one seems to last quite a lot so I really really do love this and it's sort of like a musky type of scent I feel like it's quite quite a fullish autumn scent um, but yeah I really really love it the packaging is quite simple it's just this it how many it doesn't say how many li oh yeah it does 30 millilitres so it doesn't have that much but I tried to sort of not use loads when I put it on but yeah this is just what it looks like the packaging is just really really cute and I have under half left and it's one of my favourite perfumes at the moment so I definitely recommend this for fall it's just a really really autumnal scent Next up I have a lipstick and you're probably wondering, Evie you don't wear dark lipsticks really but I got this um, NYC one for Helena last year and um, she doesn't really use it so she gave it bits back to me so it is now like mine I guess um, but yeah this is the NYC City Proof Twistable Intense Lip Colour and this is just what it looks like, it's a crayon, it's so pigmented and it's like a glossy sheen finish. It's in the shade 031 Grand Mercy Park Plum and it's just like a plumish red colour. Yeah, as, as I said, I do not really wear like dark colours, but if I do, this is definitely the one I would sort of maybe lean towards most of the time. I will do a swatch for you of this. It just looks like this. It's very deep and I feel like this is like my foolish colour that I would like to wear. It just really, really goes with the theme of full like dark red kind of purple colours. If I do maybe wear dark lips, this will definitely be one of the ones I reach for. I really, really love this. So next I have two baby lips. As some of you know, I do love my baby lips and I I have got a few more since my recent updated baby lips collection so give this video a big thumbs up if you'd like to see an like an updated updated collection um but yeah so I have these two today and I just picked out two of like my ones I've been using a little bit more recently so I have my Maybelline baby lips in Berry Soft which is a Doctor Rescue as some of you know I feel like I've mentioned this before I do love this one I don't think you can get it in the UK but I got it online on eBay for like three pounds which is amazing it's just a Doctor Rescue one so it smells like mint and medical stuff but I, I don't really hate the smell to be honest lots of people do I think but yeah it's so pigmented as you can see it's just like a mauve berry color it's very glossy very moisturizing it's great therapy for your lips if your lips are dry and cracked and I just I love this for full and then I have the Maybelline baby lips again in vanilla cupcake this is a new one that came out this is vanilla cupcake it smells so good it smells a little bit like cherries and like vanilla and amazing cake. It is a baby pink colour and it's very glossy and it's quite a light pink but I really like it. I think it's really really nice and wearable. I don't think it's too light that it might not be wearable for some people but it can wash you out so just be careful with this one but I do love it and it smells amazing and I just love it for this time of year. So this is something that I actually use like all year round. I love it so much but I thought I would include it in this video just because it is one of my favourites and I have been using it a lot recently. Um, so yeah this is the Bell's Coconut Oil. It's just a natural coconut oil um, I'm sure lots of you have heard of this for making lip balms and just like for loads of different things you can do with it. This I got like a few months back and it does expire in 2017 so I did check that it hadn't expired um, but I use this to put on my eyelash roots and my eyebrows to make my eyebrows like go a bit fuller but I have filled them in today um, but yeah and also put my on as well but yeah um, to grow my eyelashes out it does work so well for me and I believe it works I don't know it's just amazing I just use this every night once I've taken all my makeup off if I remember yeah I can't really say every night because I don't do it every night but if I can be bothered or if I 
and remember I'll quickly put some on my eyelashes and my eyebrows to grow them out and it does help so much um, so I definitely recommend this this was like £3.50 so it's pretty inexpensive and it's an actual product and it's great for growing up things like that um, like your eyes and your eyebrows and I also sometimes apply this on my lips if they get a little bit cracked during the winter and autumn time then I have another skincare item which was actually given um, to me and Helena by my nan so thank you so much to my nanny for this so it is um, a moisturizing cream I'm not going to try and pronounce the name because I will get it wrong it's Finnish um, because she went to Finland and she brought it back for me and Helena pot each but oh my gosh this smells like apples like you know when you get like apple sweets it just smells so good like I don't even know by the way I have a um, blocked nose so that's why if you hear me sniffing really weird but it smells so good and it's so moisturizing it's quite a thin formula but I really really love it it moisturizes my skin so well and I don't even feel like it's on like I have it on right now and I don't feel like it's on at all it doesn't feel tacky it does kind of a little bit when you first put it on but that happens with most creams for me but now it just doesn't really feel like I have anything on my skin I absolutely love this and it has been my daily if I ever put moisturizer on moisturizing cream right now and I absolutely love it so then I just have a mascara this is the Rimmel Colorist you might have heard of this one it apparently tints your lashes in two weeks if you put it on every Every day. I don't think it's done that like really because I have like blonde roots here but it is a amazing lengthening volumizing mascara I have it on today it is so so nice and I absolutely love it this is in the shade 001 black and I got this when I went on holiday in Spain I love this it is a all year round mascara for me I love it so much so I just thought I'd mention it because it is something that I really really recommend so this is just what it looks like and then the final beauty product I have is a MAC lipstick and I'm sure if you guys have been a viewer of my YouTube for a while you might have seen my Christmas haul and I did feature this because I got it and I think it's been in a few videos as well. This is in Velvet Teddy. I absolutely love it. I, this is my only MAC lipstick I have a MAC product. It's just so nice. It's just the packaging is so sleek and just it looks like this. It is a brown nude sort of colour. It's got a little bit of pink under tones to it and I will swatch it for you this is a matte finish that was a really bad swatch yeah so this is a matte finish and it's so pretty I love it I've sort of blotted it on my lips today just a little bit because I didn't want it full on but it is so pigmented and it dries matte straight away it doesn't dry out my lips and oh my gosh you guys like I literally have no bad things to say about this I really really want to buy some more MAC lipsticks because they are definitely worth like I think it's £15.50 than they are sold for because they're amazing and this is definitely a sort of full winter product so I thought I would include this. So next I have two more categories, I want two, three, well I have food and then clothing so first of all starting with food I have cinnamon biscuits or like ginger cinnamon biscuits, literally they are the most autumnal food kind of thing like cinnamon type things because I just feel like it's such a full sort of like flavouring and you can also get like candles and lip balms and just the smell of it is so amazing so these ones are I believe Finnish again because my mum comes from Finland which is why like there's been some Finnish stuff this is just what they look like and they're so nice I'm gonna have one now because you know they're so good and they literally taste so autumnal they're great for if you do drink tea or like hot chocolate you can have it with them but I don't so I just have them with milk because I love drinking milk but yeah these are so good definitely recommend if you like ginger or cinnamon or whatever they are so the final category that I have is clothes type things. So first of all, I have this jumper from H&M and it is a size eight, but it comes out, I think a bit smaller, but I'm not sure. This is like a creamy jumper. As you can see, these sleeves are longer than the actual like jumper and it is coming out sort of a crop sort of design. I've had this for years, so I don't know if you can get like this exact jumper in H&M right now. You might be able to get similar ones and I have seen like jumpers in H&M that are really, really nice right now. This is so nice and um, I'm definitely going to wear this this winter and autumn. It's really, really nice. So then I just have something that I don't actually wear like myself, but I want to get into wearing if you see what I mean. So these are cardigans and this is actually Helena's. It's like a grey and black and white like little design type thing. It's really pretty. This is in a size small again from H&M. H&M do really, really nice like winter and autumn clothes. Um, but yeah, this is just what it looks like and yeah. Yeah, it's just a long cardigan with sleeves and yeah as I said I want to start to wear these if I remember like a little bit more because they'd be really fun and these are also really comfy and a great thing to pair with your outfit so I just have 
this to show you all. So the final clothing thing I have is this hoodie and I love this. It's actually again Helena's but I have been wearing it non-stop. It has like a fluffy inside design which is so warm because it's getting cold in England again which it always is but you know. Um, so this is so nice to just wrap up in and go out in. It looks really really cute with an outfit and the outside part is like a purpley burgundy red. It doesn't actually say where this is from. It says F and F F right here but yeah on the front it says Washington um, 84 I just think it's a great thing to put over like a top or a t-shirt or something because it keeps you so warm and cozy and it just feels like pajamas on me but it is so cute with an outfit so I absolutely love this and I will definitely be wearing it in the full time the final thing that I have today and my full favorites is this bag right here so this is a leather suede is a suede no just leather like design bag it is sort of like a baby pink it's so cute and oh my gosh you guys I was looking for a new school bag because I just wanted to start fresh and get like a new one from last year um, and I saw this in new look and I absolutely loved it um, and I was just like I need to get this so I was planning to ask my dad if I could get it and I would pay him back but then my mom saw it and she got it for me so I came back after school and it was hanging up and she said I got this for you and I was so excited I love this so much so yeah this is my new school bag it has these little strap thingies right here a button up and then all my school books are inside right now it has a front compartment and then a massive compartment at the back and it's so easy to carry it's just like a rucksack design I don't really feel like handbags suit me that much so I like I really really like this rucksack because it's basically just my life it's so nice it's so pretty and I absolutely love it it was like 20 I think it's about 20 pounds which I think is super inexpensive for a um like bag like this so yeah I definitely recommend it and that is the end of my full favorites so that is my little collection of full favorites this year I really really do hope you enjoyed it if you would like to see any other like full videos or just videos in general make sure to leave a request down below because I am running out of video ideas and I need to like get some together so I can plan some videos and do some fun videos for you all so just leave any requests you have down below and that would mean the absolute world if you did as I said at the beginning make sure to like and subscribe and and yeah, I really, really do hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you soon.